Hello guys, welcome back to America Truck Select. We'll get in today and do that mod review of the, of the K100E from Overflow. Let's go through. So guys, the Mack truck we done, I cannot do a, a mod review. We're in the beta, the beta for version 1.5.1 .1 of the game. And that truck did not work in this version of the game. So we cannot do the, the maybe we'll do another run with it once it gets updated, and we'll do it then. And what I think I'm gonna do. Turn left. We had some times in this truck. We got a 48, a 48 foot trailer today. Go straight on. We got some uh, right. damaged goods from Walmart. Okay, do another Walmart. No, uh, let's see. No, I'm sorry, wrong load. We're not taking that. We're taking wood, wooden beams. That's what I took earlier. I already got the load mixed up first thing. So we got wooden beams. Get ready to turn left. We get on the highway here in just a minute. And we'll uh, get a thumbnail. Turn left. Get a thumbnail real quick of the truck. Oh, that looks, uh, that looks so good. A little K100, it just, oh man. That looks even better with that CHP behind us. Kind of keep our uh, speed going because we got that CHP behind us. Didn't even stop. Just merged out there like he was like he's on the road. So this trip is 137 miles. Go straight miles. on. That's right. Then he gets off the highway right there. Kind of being a little bit quiet here.
close to that cat engine. Keep right and then exit right. Exit right. Get ready to turn right. Let's not hit that CHP in the marina. Just kind of being quiet, guys. You can hear this cat engine. Hold the window down. I think I was just kind of being quiet right now. Let you enjoy the sounds of that cat engine. Turn 
lit. We're here. parked up here. So we drove exit, we drove 121 miles, took us four hours, five minutes to get here. We're using 16.5 gallons of fuel. So what we're going to do now is we're going to take a look at this truck. Alright, so let's go to the dealer. Mm -hmm. All right. So, we're going to go into Kenworth. That's the only modded one I have for Kenworth right now. The Mac, uh, I do have the Mac, um, the, the day cab working for that. I mean, the, um, uh, cab over. We'll be doing a run with that. So, this comes with multiple options. We're just going to go ahead and click on this one. Alright. So, here's your truck. It comes, like I said, it comes in the day cab with a window. It comes with a day cab with three windows. It comes with just a day cab, like that. It comes with one window. It comes with three windows. And, and the windows are in the back. You can see here. Day cab two. That's no windows. One window. Two windows. Standard. Day cab. This one actually has a sleeper. Right in the truck. Alright, this is the the VIT version of the truck. A little bit longer on the inside there. Have the after version. After version of the like that. You have a lot of cab options for the truck. Alright, as far as your uh, 
chassis go, you have a long, which I wouldn't use. I don't like that. That's a six by a six by four. A little bit shorter six by four, and then you have a four by two, which is a, a two wheel. Uh, hope it don't crash the game. Nope. Okay. We good. Oh, it crashed. Yep, it crashed the game. Let me go into the mod menu and see if I can put it at the top and see if I just top it real quick and then we'll finish the review. It is at the top. Hmm. It just still crashed it. Yeah. I want to look at it one more time. It may be because we're at the version we're in, too. We're gonna, we're gonna look at it one more time. If it crashes this time, we're gonna have to not worry about it. I think it could be because we're in the. Beta. Alright, so it starts. Okay, yeah, we're not worried about it.